Go to Joseph and do what he says to you. Pharaoh in the Old Testament says to the family of Joseph. He is the one who saved them from the time of famine and struggles. In this time of struggles and challenges, Pope Francis tells, go to Joseph and live as he lived. True human, wonderful father with a real father's heart, he comes and teaches us how to live our faith. What a beautiful saying that we have in Saint Joseph. We the Trinitarians bring to you, along with the Apostolic letter, Patris Corde, with a father's heart, reflections on the life of Saint Joseph, to enlighten and enrich your days, to celebrate the solemnity of Saint Joseph. My dear wonderful people, we have a saint of all the seasons, a saint who knew life in and out, and he said with us, universal patron and wonderful protector. God bless to you all as we make these reflections. Thank you. Come along with us. My dear friends in Christ's love, the Great Wall of China is the world's longest wall and the biggest ancient architecture. It stands just like a gigantic dragon and a huge military line of defense for the people of China. It spreads across grasslands, deserts, mountains and plateaus. In the Bible too we see a learned and a high skilled craftsman in food who became a great war. A great war in the life of Mary and Jesus. He is none other than Saint Joseph. Being a great war, he became the focal figure in the representation of the Holy Family. The Bible portrays him just like a war in so many circumstances and in so many ways. Just like a gigantic war, Saint Joseph provided safety for his wife and for his son. For that purpose, he had to face a lot many concrete problems which the family faced. Yes, indeed, God is the intelligent designer of that world. He built it with justice, courage and tender love. That resulted Joseph to accept life as it is with all his disappointments, contradictions and frustrations. My dear friends, let us examine ourselves. We are blessed with a lot many people who are seemingly like a wall in our lives. It can be either our parents, friends or dear and dear ones. Let us try to recall and remember them with gratitude. Saint Joseph as a strong and courageous man may continue to comfort and show his com compassion for the people who are needy and poor. May Saint Joseph, the patron of the church, may defend us from all the snares of the enemy. Amen.